NFL April 16, 2018 12.30 p.m. Eastern Daylight Saving Time April 16, 2018 12.29 p.m. Eastern Daylight Saving Time Our latest mock draft for 2018 features five quarterback selections in the first round and plenty of movement via trades. Use left to right buttons to navigate. Swipe left to right to navigate. With 2018 NFL draft less than two weeks away, the first round picture remains as murky as ever. The first overall pick is still included in trade discussions, and even if the Browns stay put, the discussion moves to the draft's two best quarterbacks. Add the flurry of trade talks, and this class is set to be one of the most intriguing in recent history. While teams like the Bills and Chargers might look to move up for a top quarterback, it's the teams that don't need a quarterback, like the Colts, 49ers and Raiders, that might benefit most. Sign up to stream the NFL Draft Live on DAZN in Canada. The following trades are included in this mock draft. Browns trade no. 4 overall to Bills for picks number 12, number 22 and a third round pick. 49ers trade no. 9 overall to Chargers for the 17th overall pick, the 2018 third round pick, and the 2019 third round pick. Vikings trade the no. 30 overall to Colts for the 2018 second and third round picks Getty images While Josh Allen rumors persist the Browns are likely to take the draft's best quarterback in Donald The pass so the Browns take first overall will sit behind Tyrod Taylor for at least a full year Getty images New Giants GM Dave Gettleman drafted Christian McCaffrey with the 8th overall pick last year when he was in charge of the Panthers Now he has a chance to draft an even better runner in Barkley teams have inquired about this pick, but New York seems reluctant to trade it. Getty images when the Jets traded up to the third overall pick, they knew exactly who they were targeting. New York's decision makers have made multiple visits to Oklahoma this year, and they spoke at length with Mayfield at the Senior Bowl and NFL Combine. Mayfield also has already been introduced to Jets ownership. Getty images The Bills can't leave the first round without a quarterback, they have no long-term starter on the roster, and even the short-term options would be upgraded with the addition of a rookie. While some in Buffalo's front office prefer Josh Rosen, Allen is more likely to be the pick. Getty images Denver needs to continue to upgrade its offensive line, and Nelson is the draft's best lineman. Nelson, along with last year's first-round pick in Garrett Bollesp, can help give Case Keenum the protection he needs. Getty images, a dream scenario for the Colts, they land the player they would have targeted at no. 3 A few picks later. Chubb is a special talent and the draft's best non-quarterback. If he is off the board by the time pick no. 6 arrives, Quentin Nelson and Roquan Smith will be considered. Getty images, with the Saints and Falcons in the division, the books need to keep the secondary a strength. Ward is just as talented as former Ohio State cornerback Marshawn Lattimore, and Tampa Bay with him could make huge strides as a defense. Getty images, after adding new coach Matt Nagy and retooling their offense, the Bears likely will look to add to the defense early in the draft. Edmonds, only 19 years old, is a special talent and can fit into multiple spots in the Bears' defense. Getty images, Rosen might experience a minor slide on draft day, and if so, the 49ers of all the teams in the top 10 are most likely to trade down. While the Patriots, Jaguars and Bengals all could make a similar move, the charges have been quiet during this draft process and need to start planning for the future. Getty images, new coach John Gruden would love to add to his offense, but Smith is the type of high-character, plug-and-play leader who can help solidify the Raiders' defensive talent. Cornerback also is a strong option. Getty images, the Dolphins have expressed interest in Baker Mayfield and Josh Allen, but unless they move up to the top four overall picks, they probably will not get a Kaby. Instead, they can stay in state and get a high upside in the box safety to eventually replace DJ McDonald. Getty images, after drafting a quarterback first overall and missing out on Saquon Barkley, the Browns could look to move down and stockpile early round picks. Jackson is the type of long, athletic ball hawk that John Dorsey likes. Getty images The Redskins will likely use multiple missed round picks on offensive players, but bolstering the front seven early in the draft is the best way for them to get back into the playoff hunt.
the Vare can play at the Noza 5 technique in the defense. Getty Images Green Bay needs a pass rusher and a cornerback early in this draft, and they'll likely have the choice between Landry and Minka Fitzpatrick. Landry has more upside and can be this team's defensive anchor moving forward. Getty Images Arizona locks into Fitzpatrick at no. 15 overall, and he can be their immediate Tyrion Matthew replacement with even more capability as a cornerback. If the pick is not Fitzpatrick, the Cardinals could use defensive line help. Getty Images in Aussie Newsom's last draft as Ravens GM, it would be fitting for him to select one last Alabama player in round one. Ridley is the draft's best receiver, and he can be paired with Michael Crabtree to finally give Joe Flacco some capable weapons. Getty Images moving down from ninth overall would allow the 49ers to stockpile even more draft picks and still get a player they like in Van Der Es. The linebacker is oozing with potential, and the team can't bank on Reuben Foster ever playing for it again. Getty Images Seattle is looking at the top quarterbacks in this draft as well as the top defenders, but it's hard to imagine them passing on offensive line early. It's too much of a need, and O'Neill can play left to right tackle. Getty Images Sutton and the Cowboys have been linked together for a while, and with Des Bryant gone, the pairing makes more sense than ever. Sutton needs refinement, but he has number one receiver potential. Getty Images The Lions' running game last year was atrocious. While they could add a top rusher like Darius Geese, they'd be wise to focus on their offensive line first and foremost. They can then look to the middle rounds for a runner who can take advantage of the improved blocking. Getty Images After adding Cordy Glenn, the Bengals in the draft can either look to improve their offense or add a top defensive talent with the first round pick. Hurst does not address a major need, but he is the type of defensive tackle the Bengals like. Getty Images After moving down from fourth overall, the Browns can get a high upside defender in Josh Jackson and find themselves in the sweet spot for an offensive tackle later in round one. Williams is our top-rated offensive tackle, and in time, he can develop into the franchise left tackle Cleveland needs. Getty Images While the Patriots could be looking to make a bold move up the draft board for a quarterback, they instead could fill the huge void left by Nate Solder. McGlinchey has many similarities to Solder and should be a plug-and-play left tackle in New England's offense. Getty Images Carolina needs to address some holes in its defense, but adding a playmaker at receiver would address the most immediate need to help them return to the playoffs. Moore is an NFL-ready Z receiver who fits exactly what the Panthers need. Getty Images Tennessee would love to see Harold Landry slip, and the team might even look to move up to get him. But if not, the next pass rusher on the Titans list in Davenport will have to do. Davenport can basically redshirt during his first season in Tennessee. Getty Images without many pressing needs, the Falcons should take advantage of deep defensive tackle in defensive line classes. Coaches speak glowingly about Payne's maturity and consistent improvement during his time at Alabama. Getty Images Of all 32 teams, the Saints are most likely to draft Jackson, and they've had interest in doing so since the middle of last season. With Drew Brees on his way out and the offense changing, New Orleans adding Jackson now would give him a full red shirt season. Getty Images The Steelers rarely have selected cornerbacks early in drafts throughout the last two decades, but Alexander fits the defensive scheme. They need to find help for Artie Burns, their other recent first-round cornerback, if they hope to reach the Super Bowl again soon. Getty Images If the Jaguars don't make a big move up the draft board, they're expected to add either a top tight end like Hurst or a receiver like Texas A. Hurst fills a more pressing and unique need. Getty Images The Colts make a move up in round one to get the running back they like in Jones who reminds many of Melvin Gordon. After Frank Gore's departure, the Colts need a plug-and-play running back. Getty Images After adding an offensive tackle with their earlier first-round pick, the Patriots addressing the secondary would be wise. Reed can play either safety spot and slide into a nickel cornerback role, all long-term needs for New England. Getty Images The Eagles could look at running back Darius Geese with this pick if he's still available, but adding a top. Swing tackle would be a great luxury pick and a long-term move they'll be happy they made once Jason Peters retires.